Dubai is a desert city, so water is scarce. They do not use groundwater, but instead use water from desalination plants. That means expending energy to produce that water. And this energy comes largely from fossil sources. This means considerable CO2 emissions. In this case, saving water also means protecting the climate. To reduce consumption, you have to measure it precisely. Kukulis uses smart water meters to do just that. They determine consumption and many other values, such as water pressure and temperature. And all that happens every 15 minutes. The continuous data immediately shows when the consumption pattern of a house changes. If you have a water pipe break, for example, then what would have taken a year to notice, we now notice within 15 minutes. But collecting data from 600,000 meters of different vendors is a challenge. The first thing we had to do was combine different meter types and different communication technologies into a single system, so that the data would be in a central platform where it could be processed via the algorithms. And it's been a success. In the testing phase, water losses in Dubai were already reduced by 6 billion litres, thus saving 250,000 tonnes of CO2. This system will certainly be a door opener and a flagship project for many, many other water projects around the world. And perhaps even in regions where water is much, much more of an issue and more scarce than it is in Dubai.